If you go all the way up, the time scale doesn't disappear. You can see it below. On any timeline, there are two major lines. The solid line stands for start of current error. The other dotted line crosses the timeline in today's date. So you can see if any event or time period happened before today. If you continue to zoom in the timeline, you will notice white strips. Those are for weekends. If you continue to zoom, you will see hours. When you move around the cursor, on the top it shows how many days is this position relative to today's date. For example, right now we are 5 days before today. Also, it shows exact date and time of cursor position. If you position cursor after dotted line, you can see how many days after today it is. For example, if you need to visit your friend in 20 days, you move the cursor to the right to 20 days later and create event.